He was playing pin the tail on the donkey with the blindfold on his eye. They spun him around and before he could think he pinned his tail on the wall. Yeah, he pinned his tail on the wall. He was playing pin the tail on the donkey. Put a blindfold on his eyes. Spun him around and around and around. He pinned that tail to the wall. We'll all have a thought for the man who played. Pin the tail on the donkey. We'll all have a thought for that dizzy guy who pinned his tail to the wall. One day, full of despair, in the darkest night, he walked down by the ocean. And when he got to the shore, he walked to the beach. And when he got to the beach, he walked to the surf. And when he got to the surf, he walked to the deeper water, and the water got very, very deep, and he just kept on walking. And after a while, if you had the wings of an angel, you could see him floating out towards the sea. You could see him floating on his back, just his chest bobbing in the waves. And he looked, he looked like he was, he was peaceful. He looked like he was happy. He looked like he felt that things were going to be okay. And his wife said, there are plenty of fish in the sea. And a day went by in a week or two. And the body that he had known as his very own sunk down deep into the waves, down to the bottom of the ocean. And then one day, after the full moon, in the early morning hours, just at dawn, he woke up near that very body. And he said, Oh my, what, what has happened? What is going on? Here I see my body deep down in the bottom of the seafloor, and I feel like I need to be near it, and I can't go anywhere. I can't, I can't get away from it. I can't leave it. I have to stay right here. And I said, it's going to be dawn any minute. If you will rise up out of the water, you can see the sun rising. And he said, Not right now. I can't do it right now. And I said, okay. I'll wait until, until you're ready. And when you're ready, we'll see what happens. Then one day, sometime later on, I saw in a dream, I saw him rising up from the ocean floor into the sunlight of a new dawn and I heard a song and it went like this. Well, he was a guy with a wife and a child and he loved them most of all. But then he got dizzy and in a dizzy he pinned his tail to the wall. I bend his tail to the wall. Yes, if I find him dead, floating away on a sea of vast despair. Then he woke up and he said, What's up? I thought I was way down there on the bottom of the ocean, the deep blue sea. 
And now I'm up in the air And I said, dear heart, please don't despair Your mama is waiting here If you turn to the light, to your great delight You'll find your mama in the air If you turn to the light, in your great delight You'll find that mama you need no more despair. No more despair. And then I saw a woman waiting for him with a big smile on her face and arms outstretched. And then I heard her sing a song and it went like this. She said, my son, my son, you're the wonderful one. Please be of good cheer. My son, my son, you're the wonderful one. I'm so happy you are here. She said, my son, my son, you're the wonderful one. You're the one I'll always love. Come right here and give me a hug. Good to see you, thank the heavens above. Good to see you, thank the heavens above. She took a finger. And she wiped a tear from his cheek. And she gave him a big, big hug. And, and she said, It's so wonderful to see you. Will you come with me? I have something to show you. And they walked up towards a great white light. And I could see a kind of a white glowing place there like like the white shiny shell inside an oyster that kind of a thing only very bright I was looking I was watching and I saw them walk up that way and then all in the blink of an eye I didn't see them anymore but I heard a song, that very same song. My son, my son, you're the wonderful one. Please be of good cheer. My son, my son, you're the wonderful one. It's so wonderful to have you here. It's so great that you are here. Oh, it's a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day 